New York City carriages took their usual route through traffic to come to work, but instead of parking along Central Park South, the carriage stands are now at various entrances in the park. Some are on a downhill grade, and carriage drivers say that puts added physical stress on the horses. They simply cannot rest standing downhill. We cannot park our horses downhill here. We will not. Department of Transportation crews were still working this morning to create barriers for the new carriage stand. Among the complaints is that the new location between the barrier and white lines is not big enough. For now, carriages are parked on the other side of the street, and drivers also say their routes have to be longer because of the location, and new rules have shortened their work hours, costing the industry even more money. This is a way to kind of make things safer and more humane for everyone. Supporters are applauding the change. They say a horse could easily be spooked by the growing traffic and noise at the original location. Anyone who stands at 59th Street and sees the constant traffic in both directions knows that no sensitive being like a horse should be stuck there nine hours day and night. Mayor Bill de Blasio took up the issue as part of his campaign. This is not about the horses. This is not about the working people of New York. This is about a political promise that Mayor Bill de Blasio made to New York class. The fear is that the changes are the beginning of the end of this iconic New York City institution. And carriage drivers continue to fight. In fact, lawyers are presenting arguments on their behalf in front of the state Supreme Court. And they said if they do not win, they plan to appeal. Reporting live in Central Park, Andrea Klein Thomas, CBS 2 News.